Do you have caviar and champagne dreams? So do I. But what about caviar and beer? That sounds pretty good too. Enter Caviar, a new caviar brand launching over the holidays, offering those with caviar cravings imported and domestic caviars, ranging from $12 an ounce for varieties harvested in Louisiana to $150 an ounce for imported varieties. Here to tell us more about bringing caviar to the people is caviar founder and CEO, Patrick Brown. Hi, Patrick, great to see you. Great to be here. So what is your plan for caviar? Do you want to see it a staple of football parties as well as black tie dinners? Absolutely. Uh, everyone loves caviar. If you haven't tried it, you need to. Uh, people will say that it, it's an acquired taste, and that's nonsense. Uh, caviar is fantastic. It's fantastic on eggs. It's fantastic on pizza. It's fantastic on practically anything. But it is tends to be very, very expensive. At least that's how we think of it. We think of it as a very pricey treat. So tell us about your domestic varieties. You're able to offer caviar at $12 an ounce, this one that's, here. That's exactly right. Uh, historically, caviar has been on the pricey side. What we want to do as a brand, caviar, is find that niche for a sustainable company and sustainable mm -hmm. caviar that can find the uh, pricing point on domestic caviars that allows people who haven't been able to see, recognize, and enjoy and appreciate caviar to go ahead and make that purchase and as like you said, enjoy them with the Super Bowl and with parties year round, not oh, just yeah. on the holidays. I'm all for that. Now tell us about your domestic caviars. Where are they harvested and tell us about your commitment to sustainability. Our, our Commitment to sustainability goes along with our corporate mission. Mm -hmm. We want to make sure that we are watching the environment and that we are guardians and safeguarding our future. The price points go along from, like you said, from $12 to uh, the internationals, which, which are slightly more expensive. Uh, our domestic caviars are harvested from Louisiana to the uh, West Coast, mm -hmm. uh, Tennessee, uh, Kentucky, and Alabama. And you brought a, a sampling of your domestic caviars here. This is the one that is harvested in Louisiana, correct? It's the actually no. The oh, sorry, you tell we, me. We don't have a sample from Louisiana. Oh, okay. This is our uh, ikuru salmon, mm -hmm. which is which you've seen in uh, in with sushi and things like yes. that. It's a fantastic yes. and beautiful garnish on practically anything. I'm gonna give it a little taste. And where is this one harvested? This is an Atlantic salmon. Mmm. Mmm. Delicious. Isn't that great? So good. And so tell us about this one. They get more expensive as we go around. Where's the spoon bill from? The spoon bill is from Alabama. Mm, okay, Alabama. And this one has a different look. Tell us about the different sort of shapes and sizes of caviar. Well, the, the, the eggs are referred to as berries. Mm. So when you are grading and going through uh, the process by which you set aside different grades of varieties, you want to look at the shape and the color mm -hmm. and uh, the things that go along with the natural uh, berries themselves okay. when you want to go ahead and set them aside for uh, packaging with malisol, which is a slight light salt, which you want to serve with the eggs as fresh as possible. And tell us about this one here. Where's this one from? The sturgeon is, is from uh, Tennessee. Okay. As you can see, it's a little darker. Yeah. Uh, now, depending on your own palate and what you enjoy, some people prefer the darker eggs than, as you can see, sort of an olive color on the spoonbill. Mm -hmm. uh, it mm -hmm. really is your personal preference. I like that. I and, like that. And it goes very well with different products. I mean, This is my favorite so far. I like them all, but this is my favorite so far. And then this one is your highest end domestic caviar. Tell us about this It's one. dynamite. Try it out. Ooh, it's yes. knockout. Yes. This is our white sturgeon uh, from the West Coast. Mm -hmm. And this has a, a, a white sturgeon that is actually graded up. Mmm. Isn't that nice? Fantastic. Love it. I love it. Well, I tell you what, Patrick, I will definitely be serving caviar at my next Super Bowl party. We, <laughs> we're can... glad to hear that. <laughs> Thank you so much, Patrick Brown. Really nice talking to you. Thank you.